Hello friends, uh, I am Parwiz and this is our second video in developing Qtuta Quick applications uh, with QML and PyQtuta 5. In the last video we have uh, introduced Qtuta Quick and also we have introduced uh, QML. And uh, in this video we are going to start our first application in Qtuta Quick and QML markup language. Uh, today uh, we are going to make and uh, our first window and also we are going to cover uh, some basics of uh, QML design okay uh, now open your uh, Qt uh, from the file uh, new file or project and here uh, select Qt quick application <coughs> choose and name it I give it first dots okay now next 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 and finish okay uh, if I run this uh, you will see that we have a window yeah uh, we have a window and also we have a text that's called hello world and if I click and everywhere uh, the application will be closed because in here we have mouse area and it is uh, the field is parent if I click in here you can see the application is closed and here we uh, in the uh, and here we have window <coughs> uh, it's visible visibility is true and now you can change the width of window I give it width of uh, 600 and the height also 600 uh, if I run this, you can see that we have a six by six hundred by six hundred uh, window. Uh, and here, everything is element in uh, Qt Quick application. Uh, mouse area, this is one element. Uh, we have text, uh, this is another element, and we have window. This is another element. This window is our parent, uh, and these mouse area and this text these are our child of our parent okay uh, now you can also give your window a color I give it a color of uh, green if I run this you can see that we have a green uh, color uh, also you can change the text from here uh, for example I change the text to uh, QML application or Qt Quick application Qt Quick application uh, if I run this yeah this is Qt Quick application uh, now you can change the uh, font size <coughs> Uh, okay, uh, let me first of all, uh, uh, first of all, I show you the designer of Qta. Uh, in every uh, language, uh, if you want to uh, design uh, an application, uh, there will be a drag and drop uh, components. And here also we have a drag and drop. For example, you can add rectangle, you can add text, you can add text to it in here. Uh, if I choose this uh, Qt Quick application text, uh, you can see that the, here is text color. You can change the color. Uh, for example, I want to the color should be red. Okay, you can see that it became red. And also, if I choose the this text, uh, you can change the font size from here. You can see the font is eight, but you can change this to uh, like uh, twenty. Uh, and also, you can make it bold. Uh, you can make it italic, um, give it underline, and also in here you can change the font style. It's now Arial. You can change it to Times New Roman, uh, like this. Okay. Uh, now, uh, if I come to the uh, to edit, you can see that in our text we have a color. Uh, we have a font dot family Times New Roman. We have a font dot bold. It's true. Uh, we have font dot point size twenty. If I run this. You can see that now it's 
the font is much bigger and also here we have uh, different things that uh, you can do it we have uh, opacity you can uh, give it opacity we have visibility and you can uh, invisible this like this you can clip this uh, you can give the position x y and also you can give the width and height in here uh, just simply uh, you can play uh, with these uh, components uh, uh, like this if I run this this is my first window uh, okay uh, guys uh, thank you and this was our uh, second video uh, it was the basics of window in Qt Quick and QML uh, if you like the video please uh, subscribe the channel and also uh, for the further videos, please like the video.